My next guest says he's not just a Hollywood survivor. He survived everything Hollywood be damned. Actor Gary Busey has endured a full yet tough life, and through it all, he's kept a very positive outlook. Give me two. He's faced his share of disasters, a divorce, bouts of addiction, bankruptcy, a motorcycle accident that nearly killed him, and a terrifying battle with cancer. And he's finally released a memoir to explain how a person can make it past all that and still find the silver lining in just about everything. With me now, actor and author and musician, his brand new book, Buseyisms, Gary Busey's Basic Instructions Before Leaving Earth, the Busey Bible, the one and only he is here. Welcome, Gary. Thank you. It's so nice to talk to you. I've been it's, a fan of yours for such a long time. Well, I'm a fan of yours. I watch you on TV and wonder, who is that girl? Yeah. And I'd like to have a talk with her one day, and the wish came true, the Fantastic. dream came true, and here we are. And you wrote a book. Yeah, uh, by the way, basic instructions before leaving Earth spells Bible. That's right. Okay. And, and you are a man, you have, you have found God in your travails and, you know, through the insane cocaine addictions and, and writing bounce checks. How did that happen? It happened because that's where I was at that time mentally. Mm. And uh, when you grow, you go through a process of choices to make and learning, learning the skills of living. Yeah. And that's what I do now. I love to give with love. Mm -hmm. Loving and giving are two things. When you're 74 years old, which I am, mm -hmm. you get to a place, a plateau in your life where you learn that other people's feelings are more important than yours. Yes. And it's a great thing to give that to people because they know you love them without saying it. Who are you closer to on Point Break, Keanu Reeves or Patrick Swayze? Well, God bless Patrick Swayze. He's in the spiritual realm. Amen. Do you ever have dreams about him? No, but one time I was sitting on the bench, and I felt an energy coming up from my left. I looked up, and it was the face of Patrick Swayze mm -hmm. with a spiritual trail behind him. Wow. And right behind him was the face of my father. So they came down to see me and tell me they loved me. Was that at a difficult moment for you? Or? No. No. You know, when you pass on, I've been to the other side twice. It's wow. in the book. Yeah. And uh, it's a beautiful place. You have love, protection, and uh, trust like you never felt it on Earth. You can't feel it like it is over there on Earth. But that's the way it is. Earth is a boot camp toward the afterlife. And you got to make the right choices to get there. But even if you make wrong choices, you can adjust it by saying, oh, boy, and make the right choice. Mm -hmm. Now, you were on The Apprentice twice, and, and you said you knew when the, when the president now, when he was going to run, that he was going to win. And other people who have met him have said the exact same thing about him. What is it about him that, that gives you and others that, that kind of certainty? Well, it's not a certainty. It's just a feeling you have. Mm -hmm. And what I do, I don't talk about politics. I don't want to be in it. I'm not in it. Yeah. The parties are parties, but they don't have fun. <laughs> Everything's in the book. That's right. It's, it's a great book. book. Get it's the a book. great book. Everybody's got to get the book. And, and the amazing thing about it is you cannot believe how many movies you have been in. When you get killed in the movies, yep. <laughs> when they say cut, you get to get up, wipe off the blood, change your clothes, and go home. Mm -hmm. Isn't it neat? Well, uh, oddly <laughs> enough, when you get killed as Gary Busey, you come back to life for a third time. Oh, you can. You can come back to life all the time because that's what life is, is coming back. Yep. The word death. D-E-A-T-H stands for don't expect a tragedy here because mm -hmm. you don't die. You go to a different place, and it's a lot of fun. It's great. Everything Why did you come back if it's so fun? Why did I come back? Yeah. I was told by the angel, spoke to me in an androgynous voice and thought that what I was doing was good, mm -hmm. but my responsibility to mankind, I had to look for help in the spiritual realm. Mm -hmm. And the voice said, you may come with us now or return to your body and continue your destiny. So without thinking, oh, he said, it's your choice. And without thinking, you don't think over there, you feel. Bang! I was back. Oh. I was back in life. The book is loaded with those experiences. Yeah, the book, and has, all, the book has all these stories. They're not There's acronyms. The They're Buseyisms. They're Buseyisms is exactly what they are. Where I take the letters of a word. Like hope. Hope, H-O-P-E, stands for heavenly offerings prevail eternally. Hallelujah. Gary Busey, thank you so much for being here.